Here we are, uh, second week of uh, June, was it, uh, June 13th, Thursday. Another rainy, soggy day here. It's been a cold, wet spring in New Hampshire. This is wildlife biologist Eric Orff with New Hampshire Fish and Wildlife and this week's New Hampshire Nature Notes. I've been doing these notes for about two decades and paying attention to New Hampshire's outdoors and nature for more than 50 years. So right now, uh, what's happening? Well, the tree frogs are are singing down back, are calling. Bullfrogs should start right now, anytime this week. Uh, you know bullfrog tadpoles? It takes three to five years before they mature and become adults. I noticed this week when I walked out in the morning to get the paper and stand and listen for a minute, it's definitely quieter. So spring is maturing into summer and the sounds of springs are a little more subtle. Yes, I've still got the house run off and on. And a robin's been quite active this week here along the shrubs around my house and a few other birds, but definitely the bird activity seems to be dwindling a little bit right now. Now, this year has been a great year for uh, maple seeds. They've come tumbling down, the helicopter spinning down out of the sky. It's amazing how many things eat seeds like that. They're very valuable for our wildlife. So, uh, you know, it's not just acorns in the fall, but, you know, maple seeds, they all provide a whole bunch of food for a variety of, of animals, chipmunks and mice and birds and whatnot. So, uh, uh, you know, on longer days, things are growing very quickly. Uh, so things are definitely warming up a little bit. Summer days are long and uh, gives these birds a chance to feed their young from probably 5 in the morning till 8 at night. So a lot of activity. And in the coming weeks, you know, the bullfrogs are going to step it up a bit. And uh, we should be hearing whippoorwills and some other birds, more summer-like birds in the coming weeks. And uh, the young, young wildlife is still going to be on the move, ever, ever more so in the next week or two. So lots of things to watch. Watch when you're driving. You know, watch at night. There it is, another rainy day if it rains in the evening, and not a good evening to be on the road. So avoid driving in those rainy nights if you can avoid uh, and save our uh, reptiles and amphibians. So uh, uh, third week of, of June is coming up, and uh, things are cooking.